Ni hao, buddy. This is Lost Steroid Daddy Hack the Fourth. He was drafted at 12 years old, where he immediately won a ring with the Angels, and then another ring with the Oakland A's. If you haven't been living under a rock, you know that Lost Steroid recently became the owner of the A's, and his first move was to relocate them to Shanghai and rename the squad to the Swamp Donkeys. Somehow, after two years in the league, Lost Steroid is still 12 years old. This season has been insane so far, as La Steroid has been carrying his steroid-using buddies with walk-off after walk-off, lockdown defense, elite base running, and even a legendary performance on the pitching mound. If you've been following along, you know the Shanghai Swamp Donkeys are 20 and 0 to this point, but for the sake of everyone's time, let's jump back in for Game 69. Before we hop in, let's check out the new renovations to Swamp Donkey Stadium. Fans were complaining about the lack of refreshments at Swamp Donkey Stadium, so Lost Steroid installed this drink stand. He is marketing genius as he put it up in the Shanghai Mountains, farthest away from the bathrooms to create a never-ending loop for the fans to walk from bathroom to the drink stand. Lost Steroid also installed himself a bar in right field, so him and coach can pregame every game and even greeted the fans with a warm welcome sign. The Swamp Donkeys easily have the best stadium in the league. The Swamp Donkeys are in mid-season form and haven't ran out of juice. Lost Steroid steps up to the plate in Game 69, having already dismantled the previous single-season home run record of 73 held by his teammate Barry Bonds. He smacks a perfect, perfect piss-missile parking lot pummel to add to his already impressive season. Keep in mind, this guy is only 12 years old. In his next at-bat, he keeps it in the yard, with a smack-tastic sizzler into the gap for an easy double. La Steroid channels his inner Jackie Robinson and takes off for third base. Teams have been intentionally walking La Steroid a lot this year, so he already broke the single-season steals record this year as well. It's just too easy for this kid. La Steroid figured since he already hit a swamp donkey and a double, he might as well go for the cycle, so he launches this into the right center gap and turns on the Jets for a triple. He smacked a single in his next at bat, but we ain't showing that weak ish. La Steroid puts the dagger in the Indians' poverty franchise with this thunder thwack boomstick blast, and then, of course, rips the La Steroid Airlines celebration home, cause why not? Saw a lot of Yankee fans in the comments, so here is Lost Steroid hitting a 480-foot swamp donkey off your ace to ruin your day. The swamp donkey coach is hammered and has no idea where he even is, as Lost Steroid does a little handstand into home plate to demoralize the New York fans who made the trip to Shanghai. Lost Steroid ended up going 6 for 6 with 6 dingers in this game. I also saw some comments saying that Lost Steroid can't hit a ball over the green monster, so I got to debunk those myths. Whoever commented that has definitely never seen me play baseball before. Now watch me get jiggy with it on second base. Now watch this hilarious inside the park home run. Fine, and that's a base hit. Knocks it down. Bonds around third. He scores. It's 8-2. Knocks it down. The Red Sox are literally a little league team. They don't even know how to Passes catch and throw. He wants it all. He'll score as well, and they're pulling away the by Sox seven no now. Good. The Yankees and the Red Sox need Lost Steroid badly. Look at that, right over the green monster. Another thing I've been seeing is that a right-hand batter has never hit a ball into Bay in San Francisco, so let's head over there real quick. A typical leadoff guy gets on base, yes, but also some power. Swung on, belted. That one carrying, and that is gone. Cove and the splash down home runs. It's only 309 down that line, but hitting one out there in the bay is a lot harder than it looks. The Swamp Donkeys are now 120 and 0, and Lost Steroid told the entire pitching staff that they could stay in Shanghai and he would pitch against the Rangers in Arlington. I need everyone to pause the video and predict Lost Steroid's pitching stat line in the comments, and if Lost Steroid throws a perfect game, Everyone has to subscribe. Lost Steroid turned into Lost Strikeout and struck out the side in the first. Super long day ahead for the Rangers batting lineup. In the second, Lost Steroid handles the meat of the order without breaking a sweat, striking out the four, five, and six batters. And then what do you know? Lay Heater blows the baseball by the seven, eight, nine Ranger hitters in the third inning. In the fourth, Lost Steroid embarrasses the top of the order 
taking care of the one, two, and three hitters in nine total pitches. I thought the Rangers were supposed to be good this year. Hey, nothing doing for the Rangers, and we're still knotted at zero. Corey Seager actually has a really good at-bat here, as he actually fouls off a pitch and strikes out in four pitches. Props to him for forcing a fourth pitch. Lost Steroid then puts down Seaman Man and fools Adalas Garcia with a dizzy duster disco ball loopy lollipop. La Steroid fools the seven-hitter so bad that he throws his bat into the stands. Butterfingers McGee right here. And then, of course, strikes that bum out in two more pitches. Not even sure why the seven, eight, and nine hitters stepped in the box in the sixth inning as La Steroid plays with his food and strikes out the side. These three should be sent down to single A. After the seventh inning stretch, the top of the order comes up again for the Rangers. Bubba Thompson takes a seat back in the dugout after a quick three-pitch at bat. And then, the two-hitter gets absolutely fooled by some low cheese. Got him! Two away! Nathaniel Lowe swings at some high garbage like an idiot, and we are headed to the eighth. And a nice inning of work there as he sets him down. Corey Seager starts off the eighth with a huge scare, with the first contact of the game for the Rangers. But Lost Steroid's buddy makes a play in center field. Seaman goes down on three quick yo-yo yawners, and then Garcia hits a swinging bunt to end the eighth. 22 strikeouts for La Steroid going into the ninth inning. Will he pull it off? The seven-hitter hits the ball in play to start the ninth, but we got a man there. Two more outs to go, baby. Some no-namer steps into the box, and La Steroid shows no mercy with a boomerang bullet, then a zigzag zephyr, and then puts him away with a hula hoop heater. See ya, buddy. One man stands between Lost Steroid and the history books, and Lost Steroid goes and right at him. Up the strike zone, and it looks like hitters, the he one. fouls off the second. And, it's fouled away. and then... Swing and a miss! Got him! A perfect ending to a perfect game! Just unbelievable. I was nervous up here in the booth. I can only imagine what his teammates and even he felt out there on the mound closing this thing out. Everyone will remember this perfect game, and it'll be notched in Cooperstown forever. La Steroid pitched the next two games against the Rangers and threw perfect games in both outings. But let's keep it moving to the last series of the season. The Swamp Donkeys are 159-0 and and are taking on the Houston Astros. And if there is one thing all MLB fans can agree with, it's that everyone hates the Astros. So sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, and watch La Steroid, and the Swamp Donkeys absolutely dismantle the Astros franchise. I own you, Houston. Yeah, man, I'm looking mad cute today. Hey, see ya, ball. Yes, sir. And now, he's already homered in this game. In the air, well hit. No doubt about it. It is gone. Grand slam. Big Daddy Doughboy. Swing That's and this one's ball, buddy. No Give me doubt that. about it. Grand slam. I still own you, Houston. And that one hammered. That's back. And he leaves the yard. Grand slam. Drive home safe. Hey. In the air, well hit. Score no ball. doubt about it. It is gone. The Swamp Donkeys end the regular season with an exclamation point beating the Trash Tros 161-3. to What a game. But none of that matters now. It's playoff time, baby. Baseball fans and welcome. MLB The Show brings you the American League Division Series. It's the Los Angeles Angels taking on the Donkeys. Level and impact player. Crushed in the air. Left center field. Way back there. No doubt about it. The Shanghai crowd is bussing after La Steroid hits that leadoff Swamp Donkey. This series is personal for La Steroid because the Angels drafted him but didn't offer him the $1 billion contract that he wanted to return. The rest of Game 1 was pretty uneventful as La Steroid went 5 for 5 with 5 piss missiles and led the Swamp Donkeys to a 16-3 win. Game 2 was crazy. La Steroid was filling up the stat sheet as he typically does, but the Angels forced extra innings. 
Down 14 to 13, Daddy Hack steps up to the plate, but the Angels manager intentionally walks him. You're so soft, buddy. I would have sent the ball into the Shanghai stratosphere. So soft. But he must have forgot that Sammy Sosa bats after him, and he launches a bazooka bonanza moonshot whammy to walk it off for the Swamp Donkeys. 17 to 14 win. Swamp Donkeys go up two games. Let's head to Los Angeles for game three. Welcome to Angel Stadium. MLB The Show brings you the American League Division Series. Showing the slab in today's game. Shohei Otani. May 5th, 2022 at Fenway Park. He talked... Oh, Give this is that. deep to left center. Way I'm back there. Show on his way. Gone. Do nothing without me on the team. His eighth of the series, and we're all square. It's 2-2. Two -two. That's Most his third straight game of the whole time. Singing. This dude is on fire, Let me bro. just These dunk on my coach real quick. Hey! Swing, and this ball is hammered. No doubt about it. And here is the dagger. La Steroid sends Shohei Otani and the Angels packing for Cancun. Peep the fans in the background getting hype until La Steroid pummels the ball to a different zip code. The Swamp Donkeys are heading to the next round. Let's go, baby. Let's head back to Shanghai to take on the Cleveland Indians. I mean, Guardians. Very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. Game one was absolute slaughter, and the Swamp Donkeys came out to a 15-0 win with Roger Clemens on the bump. That ball almost took down the hot air balloon. La Steroid starts off game two with a good old-fashioned bunt home run. I am certain that La Steroid is the fastest man alive. Give me that. I'm too fast for y'all. And then, I am not sure why Cleveland's base runners think they can run on La Cannon, but the 12-year-old prodigy lasers both these idiots who try to break history by being the first stolen base on La Steroid. But lock in because we are hopping into the bottom of the ninth. Down one, base is juiced for La Steroid. You probably should intentionally walk him, right? right now. One run game here in the ninth. Oh, and this one's plastic. High and deep. It's on its way. Out of here. Ball game. The yard to right, and they walk it off. Shanghai, this is for you. The Swamp Donkeys take game two, 14 to 11. Let's head to Cleveland. Out towards right center, that's well struck. Valera, raging back towards the wall. At the wall, can't make the catch, but I think he brought it Cleveland back. center fielder robs the Goats' home run by keeping plate. it in play, but La Steroid still gets three RBIs. There. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells the Swamp me Donkeys that he take game three. Like a beach. He is at the top of the game. High fly ball down the left field line. That Cleveland! This is for you! To the home run porch and left, gone! His 10th home run of the series, and they cut into the deficit. It's 3-1. The pitcher knew as soon as that ball left his fingertips, it was trouble. Right on a platter, right down the heart of the plate. I'm sorry, but big league hitters don't miss that pitch. Lost steroid figures he might as well have some fun while he is still Cleveland, so he keeps this one in the park and easily turns it into an inside-the-park swamp donkey. Top of the wall. The Shanghai Swamp Donkeys take the series and win the American League. The 12-year-old is headed to the World Series once again. If La Steroid retired today, he would be in the Hall of Fame for sure. Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Coming up, Game 1 of the World Series on MLB The Show. It's the San Diego Padres taking on the Donkeys. The Padres have been watching game film, so their strategy for game one was to just not pitch to Losteroid, but just beam him. They beamed him his first two at-bats. In his third at-bat, Losteroid wasn't ready when they actually threw him a strike, but then, for some reason, they threw him another one. Are they stupid? 
Swings and blasts one deep to left center. That's bad. You can't throw Losteroid Daddy Hack two strikes in a row and expect it not to be a 450-foot swamp donkey. Losteroid's coach is hype as he does a handstand into home plate that pumps up the all-female Shanghai crowd. In his next at-bat, Losteroid hits this clutch piss missile moonshot swamp donkey to bring them within one run and set up his teammate Fernando Tatis for a walk-off against his former team. That one is absolutely belted. What an oh, ending. If the Padres just kept beaming La Steroid, they might have won. The but the Shanghai crowd, Swamp Donkeys take game 1-9 to 8 in dramatic fashion. Now it's going to be Big Daddy. Game Joel 2 seemed pretty ordinary at first. As La Steroid started off the game with a leadoff Swamp Donkey, stared down the camera, and then sprinted around the bases because the commissioner told La Steroid if kept lollygagging around the bases, he would call him out. La Steroid hit another piss missile Swamp Donkey off you Darvish in the third inning and kept battling with the Padres the entire game. If La Steroid wins the World Series, I will give away one Shanghai Swamp Donkey jersey for every 1,000 likes this video gets. To enter, all you gotta do is like subscribe and comment what team you wanna see La Steroid on next year. La Steroid steps into the box you know, in the bottom of the 14th in the inning. Of that pitcher's mind. If he can get on, it's gonna give him one more thing he's gotta think about. Winning run at third, two down. Oh, and this one's blasted. High and deep. It's on its way. Out of here. Ball game. A two-run blast. And they walk it off in game two. He pummels that ball into the Shanghai stratosphere. That ball was spanked. The Swamp Donkeys take game two in dramatic fashion once again. 11-9. Rumors are swirling and people are asking if this is the last home run we will see from Lasteroid in Shanghai. Time for game three. Lock in. Nothing better than pregame festivities for the World Series. Game three is coming up next. Hello from Petco Park in beautiful downtown San Diego. The World Series on MLB The Show coming up. It's Shanghai and the San Diego Padres. Back here in San Diego, here's the speedy catcher, Big Daddy Dobo. Left center field, way back there, no doubt about it. I own you, San Diego. That's his seventh rep, Big Daddy Doughboy. He's already homered in this game. This one drilled to left, no doubt about it as they add on more. Gone. Circle the bases is eighth of the series, and they add a run. It's 10-1. Now he's just showing off out there, and who can blame him with a swing like that? The 12-year-old menace plays the villain role and gets a big game three win in a hostile San Diego environment. 16-9. The Shanghai Swamp Donkeys are one win away from completing the most miraculous run in MLB history. Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. The World Series on MLB The Show coming up. It's the Donkeys and the San Diego Padres. La Steroid is the most hated man in San Diego, and all the Padre fans on Twitter have been talking about how they are going to make La Steroid fear them before Game 4. Peep La Steroid's response as he steps in for his first at-bat. It was reported that a group of angry Padre fans tried to jump Losteroid in his hotel lobby before today's game. Losteroid came out uninjured, but 30 Padre fans are in critical condition. And he'll pull into second with two gone. 
just a very nice approach. And Daddy Hack there, pulls in for a double as the crowd continues to boo and heckle. Alex he turns Rodriguez. into Usain Bolt real quick and bonks third base. He is the That's fastest man of all time. That's a stolen base. In this game, you got to take what the other team is giving you. Drilled out towards left center field. That's well struck. That one back. And it is gone. His 10th home run of the series. And they jump ahead in the four. It's 4-3. Four one pitch. One I think it's safe to say that Losteroid owns the state of California as Juan Soto that's tries to lay down a bunt. Nice try, buddy. Tosses the first and that's going to do it. The Shanghai Swamp Donkeys have won the World Series. Bang! Lost steroid, Daddy Hack the fourth. The twelve-year-old owner has made history once again. Are the Shanghai Swamp Donkeys the best team of all time? Make sure to like, comment where you want to see Lost Steroid play next year, and subscribe. We are coming for that one million play button, baby. This has been the world Thanks for watching. Lost Steroid loves you. Peace.